keep food safe, it must be kept at the right temperature. Hot foods should be kept above 140 degrees Fahrenheit and cold foods below 40 degrees Fahrenheit. These temperatures in between are known as the danger zone. These are the perfect temperatures to grow the bacteria that cause foodborne illness. The only way to be sure that your food is at a safe temperature is to check it with a food thermometer. And the only way to be sure your food thermometer is accurate is to calibrate it. Thermometers should be calibrated regularly. If the thermometer is reading the temperature incorrectly, you may think that your food has been cooked to a safe temperature when it hasn't been. Not all dial food thermometers can be calibrated. Look for the nut below the dial. If your thermometer does not have a nut, it means it cannot be calibrated, and we recommend you throw it out and replace it with one that can. To calibrate a thermometer, start with a cup full of crushed ice. Add a little water to the cup, and then add more crushed ice until the cup is packed tightly to the bottom of the cup, allowing any excess water to overflow. To take the temperature of the crushed ice water, Place the stem of the thermometer at least two inches into the cup of ice, but not touching the bottom of the cup, and wait one to two minutes until the temperature reading is steady. Because water always turns to ice at 32 degrees Fahrenheit, the temperature reading should be between 31 and 32 degrees Fahrenheit if it is accurately calibrated. If the temperature reading is not 31 or 32 degrees Fahrenheit, you need to adjust the thermometer. Do so by small amounts and allow the temperature reading to stabilize before making any additional adjustments. After adjusting the thermometer, put it back in the ice water and remeasure the temperature. Repeat these steps until the thermometer reads between 31 and 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Remember to recalibrate the thermometer if it has been dropped or if it hasn't been used in a while.